Gotta love copy. Gotta love timing, too. And gotta love when you know that you intimidate someone. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I know it's kind of hard to believe that little old me can intimidate somebody. But it's true. It's damn true. You see, ladies and gentlemen, over the past weekend, we've had a lot of things happen in the WWE, a lot of surprises. But we've also had a lot of realizations as well. And when it comes to talking smack with Paul Heyman and Kayla, I have to say this past episode was quite eye-opening because it revealed to me exactly who I intimidate in the WWE. Oh yes, ladies and gentlemen, you heard it yourself. Mr. Paul Heyman. Oh yes. He said it himself to the heart of the WWE. He said you got to take out your competition no matter what. And ladies and gentlemen, what has been going on the past couple years with the Rigster and Mr. Paul Heyman? Well, we can trace it all the way back to Seth Rollins versus Brock Lesnar. And then we can go to Drew McIntyre taking out Brock Lesnar at Royal Rumble. And Mr. Paul Heyman, since you so easily have done a remarkable job at, you know, silencing some voices. Well, you've silenced the wrong voice. Yes. And you have revealed why. <laughs> now, some of you out there may not understand what I am talking about, but some of you out there know exactly what I've been talking about. Because, Paul, there have been a few things that I have not kept secret about myself. Ah, and I've assured my minions will get their payback. Okay. So be cool.